Good morning, boys and girls. This is Mr. Cordova, your principal. We hope you're having a great day today. Today is Monday, August 28th, 2017. And let's see what we have on our schedule for this week. Tomorrow, we have a fire drill scheduled at 9.30 a.m. So we hope that everyone's going to be safe moving in and out of our fire drill. Wednesday's our regular communication day and early out day schedule. If we have anything sent home with you, please make sure you share that with your parents. We also have an ELECT meeting scheduled for that day at 9 a.m. in the library. Thursday, we have a school site council meeting scheduled at 3 p.m. in our conference room in the office. And Friday, we have uh, visitors from the state coming to see how well we're doing and they come and, come and check to see our textbooks and our facilities and make sure that everything's good. And I'm sure they're gonna see a lot of great things happening in our classrooms. Let's see following this week into next week just a very quick note uh, on monday september 4th it is a holiday it is labor day so there is no school on labor day that's monday and we come back to school on tuesday so we have three days this upcoming week and to enjoy for ourselves and we also want to remind you that on on mornings during the morning we will have our bathrooms closed the main bathrooms uh, and to ensure safety of everyone. We've had too many students going in and playing first thing in the morning inside the bathrooms. That's not a safe thing to do. So we're gonna ask that students, if they have to use the restroom, go to the multi-purpose room. So please use it before you come out to the yard. If you go have breakfast, and if you come to see us uh, and don't have breakfast, you can always go to the multi-purpose room and use the restroom in there. We want everyone to be safe. We also have with us this morning, one of our fabulous sixth graders, and that is Cynthia, and she's here to help me with announcements. Right, Cynthia? Yes. To help us remember how to roar on campus, we're going to watch a video created by some Lineback alumni that reminds us how to be respectful, outstanding, always safe, and responsible when playing on the playground. It is always fun to play on the bars and sides if you follow these simple rules. Drop safely from the bars and remember that you are not allowed to stand on or walk across the bars. You are not allowed to play cat and mouse or tag near the bars. One person should be on the bars at a time going the same direction. Slide from top to bottom with feet and legs inside the slide. No climbing up the slide from the bottom. Also, only one person on the slide at a time. You must sit down while using the slide and no tummy or head slides. Have fun and don't forget to be safe and follow the rules. We can't wait to see everyone roaring on the playground this week. Now, we would like to congratulate the class that won last week's Spirit Award. Congratulations, Ms. Camula's class, for achieving 89% participation in our Spirit Wear. We hope you enjoyed having your lunch on the stage. Thank you, Cynthia, for that wonderful news. We also want to share with you that Friday, last Friday, we had our student store, our first student store open. And we had lots of students coming in, purchasing lots of great things for from the student store. And we want to be able to do that again in, a, in several weeks, in a few weeks in September. Start collecting your golden tickets, the, the tickets that you get for having a positive attitude, doing all the right things, roaring throughout our campus. And you can collect those tickets and purchase something from our student store. That is about all the news we have for today. I want to thank Cynthia for being here today with me to share some of the news. We also want to uh, ask that you do a great job and want to remind you that uh, it's always a great day for learning and it's always a great day to be a Lombok Lion.